This section will explain you how to dump the hex file from your laptop or PC to the ARM7 development board. Now let's start with the hardware connection. This is the LPC2148 development board which we are using. This cable is used as a USB power supply. We have facility that we can use a 9V adapter also for the power supply. This is an another cable which is used for USB to serial converter. If uh, you are uh, having a PC then you can directly use DB9 to DB9 or else you can use USB port like this with USB to serial converter. So now we will use Flashmagic software to dump the program from your laptop to this development board. Coming to your software section, this is the Flashmagic home screen. Make the all the settings as explained in the video section in the tutorial earlier. So once select your according COM port, baud rate, your device, your crystal frequency and browse your, L, your .hex file here. Please click verify after programming to see that there are no errors remaining when your program is being transferred from your laptop or PC to the development board. Once all the settings are done, just click on the start. You can see the process is going on on the, uh, on the bottom menu. You can see that now it is being programmed and after that it will be verified. Just wait for a moment. As you can see now that it is the finished. So once the program is finished, just remove the power supply. As we have used this white power your USB cable as a power supply source, I'm just unplugging it. Once the program, uh, once the power supply is switched off, just remove these two jumpers and switch on the power supply again. As you can see, these LEDs are blinking. These are the eight LEDs which are blinking because we have dumped the program of LED blinking uh, and it will be continuous turn on and off your LEDs. So in this way using the flash magic and ARM9, ARM7 development board we are transferring our .x file to the board. Thank you.